G'day, are you interested in science? Are you a keen communicator or a budding filmmaker? It's time to get your camera rolling. My name's Adam Spencer. And I'm Dr. Carl, and we want to see what you have to tell us. That's right, because sponsored by the University of Sydney in association with Australian Museum, the Sleek Geeks Science Eureka Prize encourages students to tell a story, communicate a scientific concept in a way that's accessible, beautiful, teaching an audience, letting them, as we like to say, learn without noticing, or as Adam does so well, laugh and learn at the same time. But this year, things are a little bit different, Carl. We're creating a theme that all the entries this year have to correspond with. Do you want to guess what the theme is? No, I want to hypothesise, and I'm sorry, Adam, I've got nothing. Give me a hint. Okay, I'll give you a clue. It's, it's inorganic, uh -huh. transparent, mm -hmm. tasteless, odourless, nearly colourless chemical substance. It's the basis of the hydrosphere and so important for life on Earth. Ah, oh, hydrosphere. Thank you for that great hint. Uh, we're talking water. So here's number one. Water expands when it turns from a liquid into an ice, and if it did not do that, there would be no life on Earth because 600 million years ago, the whole of Earth was covered with ice and all life would have dried out if ice sank. Number two, water looks like a little boomerang. H2O, H, H, a little O in the middle. So just think of all these little boomerangs here. Number three, we still don't know why water expands when it goes from four degrees down to zero. But that's also essential for life. It's so much we don't know about water. But the judges, Carl, are going to be making their decisions based on the accuracy of the scientific content, the science communication skills, the originality, and the humour involved in capturing the story of water. You might want to establish something that's already well known. You might want to put forward your own hypothesis, a famous moment in water. We don't care. And it's not about high tech. It's not about the money you put in. It's the creativity that bubbles up. But a very important change this year. 90 seconds. That's all you've got. One and a half minutes. So try and get in there with something that grabs in the beginning, an explanation, and as Adam does so well, then a joke at the end. The entries open Wednesday, March the 4th. They close Friday the 1st of May at 7 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. There are cash prizes and the chance to come to Sydney to meet me and Dr. Carl. It's free to end up. Are we excited? I'm excited. I'm so excited. And we want to sell you a block of flats in Tasmania and a luxury European car. No, that's different. <laughs>